The Chase and its host Bradley Walshy back on ITV today with The Chase. The Chase continues on our screens this evening as the latest challenges work as a team to pit the wits against a quiz genius. Here's everything you need to know on the Tea Time Favourite Show, host Bradley Walsh and of course, the infamous Chases, ITV3 The Chase fans are delighted to know there are more capers and quizzes to come when is The Chase on ITV. The Chase is back on our screens and is shown at 5pm on ITV every weekday. It goes head to head with the likes of Pointless on BBC1, Flog It on BBC2 and Come Dine With Me on Channel 4. What is The Chase? The Tea Time Game Show sees four plucky contestants go up against one of Britain's best quiz brains in a bid to win thousands of pounds. The teams compete against The Chaser, one of six know-it-all quizzes, in a bid to keep the money that they win. The Chase has amassed a huge cult following and is ITV's most successful daytime show ever. As well as catching the show on ITV at 5pm, there are some hilarious highlights that see host Bradley Walsh laugh uncontrollably at some of the questions. TV3 publicity at gmail.com 3 The chases are back and as intimidating as ever. Who is the chase host Bradley Walsh? Actor, singer and game show host Bradley Walsh is the presenter of the chase and cash trapped. He's beloved by fans for his outbursts of laughter at some of the dafter questions on the show, which have helped it go viral a number of times and sealed its cult following of regular viewers. Before the chase, he also presented Supermarket Sweep in the 1990s, and the National Lottery from 2004. Besides that he's had roles in Coronation Street, Doctor Who spin-off The Sarah Jane Adventures, and ITV's crime drama Law and & Order, UK. Getty Images 3 Bradley is a seasoned TV host and has also had some notable acting roles Bradley has been plagued by accusations of being drunk on the job while hosting The Chase, but recently revealed he actually has a medical condition that makes him look like he's had a few too many. He revealed on this morning that he suffers from blepharitis, which makes his eyes look red and swollen as if he has been on the booze. Latest on the chase does Mount Chelsea want Teen Mason Mount to come back from his lone spell at Vitesse on a mob bust can a hand suspect swooped upon as gang when for sick as we reveal new details Hall and can a hand plot to flood Ireland with 10 million euros worth of heroin and cocaine backfires Dutch courage having a beer does help you speak a foreign language on holiday study shows what a clogger is this Dutch amateur footballers miss the worst of all time selfish and unprofessional Aguero blasted by Martin Keown for going to Holland concert C-O-N-G-R-A-T-Z-U-L-A-T-I-O-N-S newlywed couple stunned to find the house turned into a zoo by the prankster friends dangerous driving Dutch footballer Ramon Lewin rushed to hospital after being run over by scooter at training ground joined the club Dominic Silanke lands golden ball at FIFA under 20 World Cup to join illustrious club of past winners who hunt his red hot Chelsea's Lewis Baker banned from talking club future by Eddie Boothroy during England U21 duty for the fans Dutch side introduce paper point season ticket which allows fans to watch for free if team lose Hitler's lost city inside the Nazi tunnels hidden deep beneath the Dutch countryside which 135,000 people called home he said I have to take one pill a day for it or why really struggle I'm going to need my eyes operated on at some point to sort it out so many times people have commented on how I look but they don't realize. If I take medication, though, I'm fine. Blepharitis is a chronic eye condition which causes itchy, sore and swollen eyelids, and Bradley has been suffering with it since he was a teenager. He had to deny being drunk during an appearance on Weekend Cookery Show Sunday Brunch late last year. Viewers flocked to Twitter to ask if the TV star had been boozing, but he later insisted he was sober. The chase's Bradley Walsh left in hysterics over rap.